This is what Jeff Colbert and his son saw on their drive home to North Natomas. Mm -hmm. He tells me they rushed back. We need to hurry up and get back home. And I saw like a really big tumbleweed coming this way, you know, towards the house. So it's kind of like, ah, it's burning towards us. They started packing up. A pillow and just like, you know, uh, baby diapers. Grabbing keepsakes like a teddy bear and photo album. As one family packed, another says they were stuck. You couldn't even move a car. I mean, it was just solid cars all around the house, all around the neighborhood. I-5 north and southbound were shut down for hours, diverting traffic and clogging up roads in Pennington's neighborhood. If the fire had gotten any worse, we were kind of concerned because we couldn't even get our car out of our driveway. His seven-year-old daughter, Isabel, shaken. This was so close to home. The flames were getting pretty high. In the middle, the freeway was burning down. The flames in the field were going as fast as the car. According to Sacramento Fire, the quick-moving flames started here at the Hilton Garden Inn Hotel in North Natomas. A crew seen cleaning up outside an equipment room. As a burn scar outside the hotel marked the start of the grass fire, firefighters say the spark spread from the hotel to I-5, stretching three miles down towards I-80. It did start to get out of hand uh, rather quickly. Uh, when it's wind driven like this, Mother Nature is in control. The fire department, we, we're going to do what we can and get our resources to, to where they need to be as quick as possible. But these situations, when they're wind driven, uh, it's, it's a force that we can't do anything about except try to just keep moving our people and get ahead of it. Firefighters took control and extinguished the flames as three burned out cars were left along the freeway at the spot where drivers plowed through a fence to escape. You think living out here in a tomato field that, you know, it's, it can't happen here, but you know, it's possible. And, uh, uh, it doesn't need to be out in the forest to, to happen.